we are going to discuss about the project title Parkinson disease detection using deep neural networks Parkinson is a very complex problem and there is no proper scale to predict the severity of Parkinson disease it is a neurodegenerative disorder that affects the motor function due to the decline of dopamine level in the brain and hence effects are being observed physically on the body every day there are lot of new cases of parkinson coming into the hospitals showing different and new symptoms the study that takes some features has an input to produce the proposed system has neural network to predict the disease In this project we are going to mainly focus on the problem statement to predict the parkinson disease from the data set and also from the speech file but here we are going to use the algorithms are support vector machine exibus algorithms multi layer perceptron and cnn algorithm hardware requirements we need operating system windows only processor i5 and above ram should be 4 gb and above hard disk should be 20 gb and above coming to the software requirements we need to install python with the version of 3.7 methodologies to implement this project we have implemented few modules that are first one upload parkinson speech data set using this module we will upload all the audio files folders to the application and then generate read all audio files and then extract the features from it next module pre processing data set using this module we will replace missing value signed with the mean value and then normalize all extracted features using minimax scaling and then split the data into training and test where applications used 80% of data for the training and 20% of data for the testing then third module train support vector machine algorithm using this module we will train support vector machine algorithm with the process to train data and then apply train data model on 20% of test data to calculate the prediction accuracy then fourth module train exibus algorithm using this module we will train exibus with the processed train data and then apply trained model on 20% of test data to calculate pre- prediction of accuracy then fifth module train multi layer perceptron algorithm using this module we will train multi layer perceptron algorithm with the proposed train and data and then apply trained model on 20% of test data to calculate prediction accuracy then last module train cnn algorithm using this module we will train cnn algorithm with the proposed process to train data and then apply trained model on the 20% of data to calculate prediction and accuracy then coming to the next module that is prediction of parkinson's from the test speech using this model we are going to upload the test audio based upon the speech files and then extract the features and then apply trained model on the extracted features to predict whether the speech is having healthy or contains any parkinson's disease then last module that is comparison graph using this module we will plot comparison graphical representation between all the modules that are all the algorithms in this project then coming to execution close this file and open the code file this is the code file consist of model file this model file contains dot hx files which contains algorithm information and can be loaded into the project code during the run time to utilize the trained model for various tasks such as making prediction on the new data or performing specific operations then next one this is the parkinson data which consist of read and text read and text analysis of the audio files and pre processed data and test speeches for testing the model and this is the main code file and this is run bad file this run bad file instead of executing the program in command line interface we created windows bad file to execute the program now by clicking double tab on it it leads to the user graphical interface which is interactive with the program users 
Now first button upload Parkinson's speech disease by clicking this button you can see the dialog box open and select the Parkinson folder and select the folder now you can see that Parkinson data set is loaded and you can also see the features which was read and also the zero indicates the Parkinson diseases and one indicates the healthy of the classes in the x axis it indicates the labels and in the y axis it indicates the number of count of the classes present in the parkinson data set and close this graphical representation and these are the extracted features from the speech files then next to one pre processing data set by clicking this button you can see the training and testing percentage of the data set which we used our 80 percentage consider has training part and 20 percentage has the testing part the next button try and support vector machine algorithm by clicking this button you can see the confusion matrix which was generated by the predicted class and also true class with the healthy and parkinson classes of the data set now close this graphical representation and you can see the graphical user interface the accuracy of support vector machine and then next one try and exibust algorithm by clicking this button you can see the confusion matrix of the exibust algorithm and also predicted classes and healthy classes based uh, parkinson diseases based upon the true classes now close this graphical representation and see the accuracy of exibust algorithm then next one try an mlp algorithm multi layer perceptron algorithm by clicking this button you can see the predicted classes of healthy and parkinson disease and true classes of healthy and parkinson disease based upon the multi layer perceptron confusion matrix algorithm by closing this graph and you can see the multi layer perceptron algorithm accuracy precision and recall score and f1 score the next algorithm that is try and cnn model algorithm by clicking this button you can see in the back console it loads and the algorithm data and it indicates the graphical representation of confusion matrix and also it shows the predicted classes and true classes based upon the cnn model and it indicates the accuracy precision recall and f1 score of the cnn algorithm then next one predict past parkinson for test speech by clicking this button you can see the all the audio files which contains to test the data so now click on the any of the uh, audio file and it will generate the speech values extracted values and also it indicates that parkinson disease is present or not so you can see here the speech file has predicted has parkinson disease now check with the another test speech so and click on open so now you can see the test data which was linked here extracted samples from the speech file and also it was predicted as healthy in this format we can use the algorithm which was predicted the highest performance to test the data that is affected with parkinson or not by using the test speech also now click on the comparison graphical representation now you can see the different graphical representation of algorithms which we have used in this project so comparing all the algorithms we can see accuracy of convolution neural network algorithm is highest and in the x axis you can see the labels mentioned of the algorithms and in the y axis you can see the count of the accuracy precision recall and f1 scores frequency levels now close this graphical request uh, graphical representation and you can exit the code now go to the conclusion So in this project we have found that by using CNN algorithm and by using the voice note of the patients that is speech recognition data set we have inspired that CNN algorithm is predicting with the best performance from the all the algorithms of the data set in this project to predict the parkinson disease or from the patients thank you
Thank you for watching video. For more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in. For updates on latest project videos, please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.